nigga, this that gang, it's the shit. Yeah. This that gang, it's the shit. Yeah. What you know about it? Lego. 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 I've been realizing that battle rap is not the fucking main priority in my goddamn life. I stepped away because I need to refocus myself and realizing that it doesn't matter what nobody thinks about me in battle rap. Because outside of this shit, I'm the man. People depend on me. I'm a fucking role model. I take care of myself, my family, everything around me. And I got distracted with this battle shit. It, it consumed me. I, it was fun, and then it became a job. And I don't like fucking working. So... That's it. My, my my hobby became a job, and I needed to fall the fuck back. It just ain't been blogging. It's been everything. I fell back with battling, period. You know, shout out to the league to try to book me, and I said I wasn't available. I just, I wasn't there. I took the Tech 9 battle because I don't like the fact that leagues and, and, and battle rappers try to take advantage of a situation where they thought I was at a weak point. So I had to prove myself like I've been doing my whole career and my whole life. Oh, you think shit is sweet with me? You think I'm a dick right now? So cool. Let's go on the stage that supports you, that don't fuck with me, that all the odds is against me. I'm going to go out there and I'm going to show out. And that's why I did. And that's why I took the battle. And that's just motherfucking that. It changed the fact that I just think he's just that dirty that it takes four years for him to feel like he can show up somewhere. You know, dealing with a, 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 a battler like him is like no other because it's like it takes hype away of not knowing what he's going to do as far as is he even going to show up. Usually you're worried about what your opponent's going to say. We have to be worried if he's going to get on the fucking plane. This shit is dirty as fuck. Dirty couch change the size when he wants to show up here, show up there. And it's like, that's what takes away from it. So the, the hype that I really, really want to feel, I can't feel until he hits up ARP and says, yo, I'm in New York City. Other than that, he's a great liar. He's done it before. I don't know if he's doing it again. He's never flat out said, yo, I can't make it. Yo, this and this is happening. No, it's, it's, it's bullshit you to the last minute. And then it's like, all right, well, fuck me, eh? I'm not showing up, you know? Fuck you! Yeah, we squashed it. At the end of the day, he'll be a bitch, and I'll be a bitch if anything happens that day other than rap. Because at the end of the day, we ran into each other face-to-face -face outside of a venue. We could have fought. I could have snuffed him. He could have snuffed me. We could have hit. It didn't happen. We talked like men. We realized we needed to get our shit off on the stage because of the shit we have built up. And for the fans, for the league, for him being the no-show god, all this dirty shit that's been going on. Is going down this fucking day. That's I have a lot to say, but as far as all that extra shit, nah, I ain't a bitch, and and I don't think he is either. So if, if it was gonna go down, we should have been for it. We was face to face. It didn't happen. We here to work. Ain't nothing new for me. I'm the underdog in every battle I went into. No matter if I battled someone that they considered more on my level, a top tier, a favorite, it is what it is. I mean, ultimately it's because I'm always battling people's favorites. Clean is a favorite. So me going at clean, of course, they gonna go with clean. They gonna go with DNA. They gonna go with that. They gonna do this. They gonna pick these opponents because these these motherfuckers have years of fans. It's like, and then you you announce me, and it's like, damn, Jim's is back again. Like, and it's true. No one's thirty in me. Why are these leagues booking me? Why am I getting paid? Why have I been around the country? It's not because I'm all the way trash. I'm I, right, but they don't even want to give me that. Well, here we go. Show and prove all over again. November third, bitch. Yeah, I agree with the fans, and I think if yeah, I asked Goods the same question, he would agree too. It's probably the worst showing from both of us. I can't really speak for him. I just know one thing I learned from that is I'll never let a league or battler or anyone around me talk me into doing something that I'm not ready for at the time. I think I took the Goods battle because he finally agreed to take it, 
But at that time, I was my mind wasn't focused where it should be. Right now, that's all behind me. I oversee, I over, I passed all that shit that I was going through, what was on my mind. Like I said, good and bad things. And now I'm completely focused. I, I, I feel like I made up for it with my last battle, but that last battle was on a different league. I need to make up for it for RBE. Like, I need to remind motherfuckers when I hear brick by brick, I know I helped put that wall up. I'm a part of that. That cement that 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 ARP shot to build with they brand, I'm a part of help building that. I need to remind people why the fuck I'm here. I'm making up for it for the RB crowd, for ARP, for shots and for my motherfucking self. It's going down. It's just I'm trying to like I'm gonna show y'all I can rap. Out of all my battles, I never showed y'all I can rap. That might be confusing to some, but you won't see November third. So then, stop being dirty. for some years Mills comes from that so it's not foreign it will be interesting because it's, it's a lot of personal shit there people that know each other crews that know each other food that's, I that's what I'm saying I think it's a personal thing here. when I say you whack I ain't just talking about your raps you whack like you a whack nigga I'm gonna show you why bro Business. They handle business perfect. This is my fault. I'm in here and I'm pushing the battle back. I'm postponing it because a lot of shit's going on. Listen, listen, listen. Why are we supposed to do this in Detroit, your city? Every time y'all get on stage with me, all that shit show. Like all y'all attributes, they go away when y'all battling me because the the real gonna outweigh the fake. It's gonna always sound good until it's against some shit. You heard what Money Mike said a long time ago. A 300C look like a phantom. Yeah, until you pull up next to one. <laughs> Bruh, stop hitting me up for a trailer. I'm, I'm done with trailers. Y'all want a trailer? ARP wants me to send in a trailer? Go look four years ago when we tried to do this on the trap. Or how about on RBE platform? You still got that footage? I'm done talking. I don't want to do no face-off, no press conference. Fuck all that. There's 10 interviews out. That's how I felt about it. You know what I gotta say to clean two things? Show up. Gems, you should feel disrespected. But we don't get into that. As far as you, only decide on coming, cause I owe ARP some money and I wasn't sending it back. Everybody's saying female battle rap is dead. It's not dead, my nigga. I battled official this year, I battled 40, and now I'm battling QB. It's alive and wealthy. Y'all niggas ain't paying attention, that's on y'all. Fuck that shit. This strap was made just for her. So don't y'all cock block. Or I'ma leave chalk wherever y'all try to jump me at. Let's play hopscotch. <laughs> November 3rd, Shuni the Rapper versus QB. RBE. Everything golden, bitch.